Hey, this place isn't half bad. What do you think, Kosla? I think you two need to get out of here. Go home or something. That's not going to happen. My home was a laboratory in North Ontario. Have you ever been to North Ontario? Center of the airport? No, it's in Canada. And there's nothing for me there. Well, you guys cannot stay here. This is literally our first night here. And if my dad comes home to find two androids messing up the place and using up all of his Wi-Fi, he's gonna flip. What do you want me to do? Go back to Dr. Peters? Yeah, no shot. Why not? He obviously wants you back. He helped us break you out. <clears throat> Didn't it seem strange to you that those warper guards are waiting in the exact spot we were supposed to escape from? It's the exact spot Dr. Peters led us to. I'm sure there's a logical explanation for that. The only one who knew about it was him. Use your brain, dude. You got played. I don't know about you, but I'm not in the business of getting played. Uh, speaking of played, I got next. <sighs> Rematch. If you want to lose again. Incompetent. Idiotic. Feeling about it was one thing, but seeing your ineptness is quite another. It's almost as if... Wait a minute. Run it back. About five seconds. Pause it. Now enhance. Get the senior tech. Now! I may have found something we can use. I recognize that look. That's a proud mommy smile. <laughs> I am gonna miss them, that's for sure. Thanks for letting me work with Frankie. You know, Beto has really shown me how important androids can be to us. I mean, I know people say they're just machines, blah, 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 but we know that's not true. They're part of us, part of our lives, and part of our families. Huh?